Hey guys, Sponge Murphy here. So, still getting these two storm from the finished. I got a bit done during the week, and it's gonna be a late night pain. I didn't do any updates because I kind of just carried away the last time I did it, and it was just too late to record anything. So, um, newest update I'll show you. Um, I think. Oh well, obviously I got the shield done, and then moved the camera down a bit. So I'm trying to focus in the background. Um, I got kind of most of the colours done on the shield. Just a few little small things to do on that. I got the little satchel, little bag thing, and the side of them finished tonight as well. Um, got the arms with the skin and everything and the fur and all done. Um, it was just tallering flesh for the skin with um, what was it? No colour use. Cadian flesh tone just to go over it a little bit and vermin brown for the for the fur with a bit of with a agrax or shade wash over it. And then I got the, the blade on the well I got the whole thing done actually of the uh not spare halberd. So I kinda got kind of the rusted kind of you well used effect on it, which I'm pretty happy how it looked for the first time doing it, you know, it's not too bad. Zoom in a bit. Get a better look at it. You know, the highlights and the silver highlights could be done a lot cleaner. But, where is it? There it is. But, you know, I still think it looks pretty decent. For tabletop standards, it's, it's fine. It's pretty good, like for that. So, um, I think the other guy is pretty much the exact same then. You know, in case Halbert, there's not much difference in the like there's not really one better than the other or anything. I think this one's a bit nicer looking. So we turn it around. Yeah, so and then his other hand. I said the shield this guy has another knife. Which I just had to get that base handle done. Um I don't know what colour I want to do because I just don't do it in a metal colour because it'll just look like Maybe if I could just do a plain metal colour. But don't give it like a rusted effect on it. So maybe that might stick out a bit better. So tonight I got started on doing the two heads. Um let's have a look at this guy. Let's zoom in. Yeah, don't focus on that. If I just zoom back a little bit. There you go, that's a lot better, I think. Um yeah, so I got the helmet to match. I'll put that there just ah oh, there you go, much better. I did the helmet to match the armor, you know, the red colour. Um then I smoked the same colours then for the flesh for the face on him. And then just with a bit of Ushabti bone for his teeth. And then vermin brown again for the fur parts. Um and then I just, just did an Agrax Earthshade wash all over it. And now I'm just going to do the last few little highlights. Kind of just blend it out a bit. Or make it stick out a little bit more. So that's the plan for tonight. For the rest of the night. Let's just look at the other head. This one's it's not too much of a difference. I know the, the other helmet has a bit of a point on it. I'm just going to focus on it all. And there you go, it's looking a lot better. I was going to try and do like a red eye on it, like a red pointy beady eye. But I might just leave it to the very end because I don't think it's going to stick out too much if the helmet is red. So, yeah, I think the teeth kind of look pretty decent. Nice and kind of yellowy white type of colour. Yeah, so I'm gonna get the two heads finished tonight. And probably just do a bit of red on the um the handle of the knife. So just keep watching and we'll see the next update in a second. Alright so I got the heads finished. 
Um, the only thing is, I think I should have just went with a blazing orange highlight instead of the a brighter red on the edge of the helmet. I think it would have come out a lot nicer. The blood red doesn't really highlight too well. I couldn't just get the, I just couldn't get it right pretty much. But then um, the layer of the skin went up, went on a pretty easy as well. So it's, it's kind of makes it stick out, stick out a little bit. If I can get it to focus. There you go. Yeah, so. Yeah, they, they, they come out pretty decent. You know, I think I'm on the right track. I'm definitely on the right track for getting these the way I wanted them to be. Like, out of a unit of 20, probably like the last five will probably end up being happy with. Um, yeah, I just did like the book. The butt or the handle of the knife, and get it. Um, just like a black wash over the metal. But one thing I did do was the blade and the halberd on this one. I went over the game with a black wash just to give it that more metallic look. And I think it does make it look a little bit better, a little bit more darker instead of a bit more instead of the more rusted kind of effect on it. So I saw you, I did I did that with that one and then this one I didn't do anything with. I just left it with a more kind of rusted colour on it. Kind of the brownish one. So um yeah, so tomorrow I'm gonna get the heads off. I'm sticking to the body and do like like a proper video on like an in decent light. Like you can't get decent light now with it's like a stag outside bulb in this room is isn't the best um yeah so tomorrow i'll do a proper one get some proper pictures and everything and get a look at the, the model in full then so hopefully it should all come together so um thanks for watching let me know what you guys think and uh, make sure to check out tomorrow's video and see the final look of it thanks for watching i'll see you guys next time